We're getting a look inside the Racine home where more than two dozen dogs were rescued last week. You can see the animal cages stacked on top of each other, dog food on the floors. Those rescue dogs now being treated at the Wisconsin Humane Society. Ricky Mitchell met with a few of them today. Ricky. Steve, we got to see three of them today. They still seem a little nervous to be around people, but overall the staff here say they are doing much better. The smell of urine was overwhelming. Angela Speed with the Wisconsin Humane Society says it was heartbreaking to see the conditions these 26 dogs were kept in. In any situation when you're dealing with that volume of animals housed together so closely, it's very stressful for the animals. Um, it's loud, it's dirty, it's smelly. Um, and so we're giving them several days to kind of adjust. Police arrested the dog's owners, Heather Jensen, and her boyfriend, Terry Bogard. They each face 26 charges charges of intentionally or negligently mistreating animals. Two of the dogs were allowed to stay with relatives of Jensen's. The other 24 are now at the Wisconsin Humane Society. They've all been seen by the vet and are receiving treatment if needed. Some of the dogs are working with our behavior staff uh, to warm up because they're fearful. The Humane Society has learned a few dogs like Harrison even have some training. Just today discovered that he knows how to sit, he knows how to shake, he knows down. She says they've seen improvement in just the last few days. This morning I came into work and I saw one of the dogs walking outside, um, wagging his tail with an equally joyous volunteer, and their futures look so much brighter than they did on Friday afternoon. And the dogs are still part of a criminal investigation, so they're not available for adoption yet. If that changes, the Humane Society says it will post updates on its Facebook page, and we have a link to that at TMJ4.com. Reporting live at the Wisconsin Humane Society, Ricky Mitchell, today's TMJ4. I'm sure people will line up to take them home when they're ready. Ricky, thanks.